Today we're speaking to Professor Ben Turok. He was the main drafter of the economic clause in the African National Congress's Freedom Charter. Ethics is not a matter of rules. It's a matter of an ethical position, of a morality. It's not a breach of one rule or another. It's a state of mind. It's an attitude, you see, which had not been articulated. Mm -hmm. I wanted the ANC in particular to say that our job in Parliament is to serve the national interest and to serve it objectively and without partisanship and without personal benefit. So I thought in the end, let's not take a rule position, let's take a philosophical position. What is the right thing to do? What are the key fundamentals of that philosophy that you managed to impart on your committee that's responsible for ethics? You are governed by the national interest, not by private interest. And whenever you make a judgment about a consultation, about talking to business, etc., your accountability is to the national interest and not to your own interest. And if there's any danger of any personal interest intervening, then you have to act. Because ethics is the end of it all. At the last National General Council, the President admitted very serious deficiencies in the ANC. Misconduct, lobbying, fractions, and so on. And my reaction to that, if a leader of an institution or a group of leaders of an institution admit such serious failings, then somebody has to resign. We want to see a signal, an admission of failure. I get sick to the stomach of hypocrisy. And I reckon if we had a secret vote in caucus around Nkandla, I think that we would have a majority against, damn nearly. And I would advise that the membership and the public as a whole should say to the ANC, your performance is, as you admit, not up to scratch. It's time for change. I think they must continue to protest. I like the protests. Why? I think we need to shake up our system. I think governments and even the leadership of the ANC have become too static, too complacent, self-satisfied, even self-serving. And the necessary commitment to the public good is not evident. And uh, there's a lot of hypocrisy and tokenism. And that can only be shaken up from the bottom. So as far as I'm concerned, let it roll.